How are we YouTubers? I'm just out walking Oscar. Now, we've got hard rubbish pick up in area area. Now, I'm gonna show you something, right? See this? This is uh, um, elderly people, right? See how they put their rubbish out? Right? See that? Right. Now, I'll pause this. I'll pause this, right? And I'll show you. But have a look, see? There now. Now, I don't know here. Yeah, I'll show you over here. You get the idea. So, see all that? Nicely stacked. Yeah? Okay? So, this is where I ask the question. Why do we have to change? Why? Have a look at this. It's just thrown. It's fucking plastic. It's, it's, it's hard rubbish to say hard rubbish, meaning it's not what you can normally put in your bin. They do it once or twice a year. Don't put rubbish out. Anyway, I'll, feel, I'll, I'll take a shot of the next one. You'll love that. Okay, bye. All right, so it's another hard rubbish thing. Now you can tell these people are ethnic. Hi, oh, mate. That was Tony. Have a look at that. Look what they put out. And they've piled them up nice and neat. Look, they've even laid everything down. So if people want to come and take it, it's all right. It's not messy. See? Right? But I'll show you the best one. It's coming up. All right, hang on. How are we, YouTubers? It's hard rubbish, right? Hard rubbish collection in reservoir, right? Now, years ago, in every suburb, when it was hard rubbish, it was, that's what it was. It was hard rubbish. It wasn't rubbish. Right? The idea of hard rubbish is it's not rubbish that you could throw out every week. It's rubbish that's thrown out once or twice a year. Right? And I'm just going to show you what hard rubbish looks like now. Okay? And in the videos before, you'll see how the older people in the area still treat it as hard rubbish. And they pack it neatly because it's still usable. It's not actually rubbish. It's, they just don't need it anymore. So people are welcome to come along and take it. And they've laid it out on the ground nicely. But just have a look at these. All right? Just have a look at this. This is just fucked. You know why? Because everyone's all about change, right? Well, you know when I was a kid? Probably when you were a kid too, you are about my age, right? Hard rubbish was fun. We found a go-kart. You know, people used to take furniture that was good and put it in homes. It was good stuff. Now it's just rubbish. It's literally rubbish. It's nappies, it's dirty fucking... It's just rubbish, mate. Have a look at this. Have a look at that. It's just fucking shit. Look. Just shit. Look. Look, see? And then you get the fucking dickheads come through here, and because it's put out it's put out messy, it's not look, made to look neat, they mess it up even more. Now this is my stuff. Right? Now I pack this out neatly, right? Okay? I'll put out this neatly. A lot of it's gone. Right? That's not my TV, by the way. That's this. Right? Okay? Right, now have a look at this. This is the best one of the lot. This is fucking disgusting. She lives in our fucking, you know, in our place. Anyway, I don't know. Have a look at this. This is out of one person's fucking house. Right, have a look at this shit. It's just shit. Look, it's fucking rubbish. It's just rubbish. Look, look at that. Look, just thrown there. Look at it. They've just picked up the fucking furniture and just thrown it out. Look, and this is from the road, yeah, look at that, it's just fucking shit, I don't give a fuck mate, I'm over this, people want change, oh, I want change, I'm an independent person, you're an independent fucking pig, that's the problem, and I went a bit off track, that's why I'm re doing, re redoing this part, right, I went a bit, look at this, this is a footpath, look, Look, look at it. You know, oh, fuck. You know, everyone wants change, yeah? yeah? Everyone wants change, right? I don't want a bit of change. Everyone's, I, I, I reckon a, a, a change is good, you know? Yeah? No worries. You know, but this is just getting fucking ridiculous. And now it's to the point where, you know, it's even our youth, our children, our babies, when they're going to school, kindergarten and stuff like that. They, they, I'm not saying they're not, they don't have any rights, yeah, okay? But people need to understand, when we were growing up, we were fucking seen and not heard. 
and we were made to listen. You had to listen. And if you wanted to say something, you know, it, 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 it should be important. You know, children today, I I've, I've see kids interrupting their parents, just not interrupting their parents, interrupting a conversation that their parents is have their parent is having with other people, right? And the kid comes up, yeah, get it, oh yeah, and the, and she'll stop or he'll stop. Yes, darling. What? If we did that, if we did that when we were kids, hey, what? What am I saying? That's what it would have been. It wouldn't have been. It would have been a look. That look, you know, that look. Um, that's it. You know, there was. You, you were polite. We're instilling into our youth, our children, from a very young age, is that they are. It's expected. You don't tell me what to do. I tell you what I want. That's what it is. You know? Fucking hell. School teachers have to walk into the classroom now. And they, you know what they say? How do they greet their children? Their, their students, sorry. Their students. Good morning, friends. Uh, fucking hell. But getting back to this rubbish, right? This is a, a, this is a fucking reflection of what we're letting into this country. Okay, it is. Really? Okay, I'll tell you. That house down there, that run I showed you down there, Indians. They just come through there all the time. All the time, right? Okay. Here, she's a single mum, and her daughter is now a single mum. So, you know, go figure, right? Eh? <laughs> like mother, like daughter. Fucking slut. But anyway, right? And, and she's, uh, but anyway, right? But our environment, our environment has changed. The only filth, you're honestly, and I'll tell you now, the only fucking filth that we had to put up with, right, is when we went out to the outback, which is supposed to be very nice, especially when, you know, the white man come along, if you want to call it that, and we set up shops and, 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 and you know, service stations and bottle shops and stuff like that. And then you, you knew when you were coming close to the, you know how you know when you're coming close to the outback? You want to know how? When a goom bag hits you in the fucking face while you're riding along. That's how you know. Yeah, yeah, we're close. We're close to the middle of Australia. <laughs> they have to stand in the fucking middle because they fall off, they fall off the fucking edge. Well, but this is a reflection of what we're living in this country. Have a look at India. Is that clean? The bottom of fucking, you know, um, what's the fucking tallest man? Oh, fucking it just. Oh, man. The mountain that's Hebron, Hillary, Hillary, Mount Everest. The base of Mount Everest. They showed it, right? There's over 50,000 tonnes of rubbish at the base of it. And that is supposed to be a wonder of the world. Come on. You know, it's like the pyramids. You know, less than three kilometres away, there's a fucking dirty town there with the fucking dirty Arabs and whatever else they're going to call it, trying to rip you off and stuff like that. And they smash their coach buses every now and again on the way back full of tourists, right? But there's toilet paper flying around there. My, my mate went over there, right? And he got ripped off, right? Because what the fuckers do is there's toilets there. And the fucking Arabs around there, like this, acting like, you know, they, they know what's going on. They've got no fucking idea, right? And they, they stand near the toilet. You know what these fuckers have done? When they've gone in, when the workers have gone in in the morning and put the toilet rolls on, they go in after they've gone and they take the toilet rolls. <laughs> when my mate went in there, they dropped one, right? And he's, he's, in, and he's come out. He's gone, there's no toilet paper. Yeah, I can help you here. Here, yeah, sir, I can help you. Hey, 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 five rupee? Five hundred thousand rupee? That's how much it's going to cost. It was for fucking free. Since when do you pay to wipe your ass? You know? I would have just fucking got the sand. Like in the old days, you know? But, I mean, this is just a reflection of what we're letting in this country, isn't it? Hey? Do you fucking see... Do you see Germans doing this? Huh? Do you see the Swiss... Do you see the, the Asians? Do you see the fucking, you know, the, 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 um, the French, the English? I mean, all right, we've got pigs around, yeah, but not like this. I mean, these fuckers, and this gets me, right? They didn't pay for any of this. All that they didn't pay for, they get it for nothing. The government gives it to them. So why would you fucking appreciate it? It's supposed to be hard rubbish. Here's this filth. Let's take another look at it. It's fucking disgusting. Look at it. Look at that. It's 
just fucking filth. You know. Oh yeah. Yeah. The 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 modern world. Yeah. You know what you tell you what the modern world's fucking done? Well you fucking uh Gen Z's and whatever, you know what you fucking done? You've done nothing. You've just exploited what your forefathers invented. You haven't fucking carried on with it. You haven't even fucking towed the line. Nothing. You're fucking useless. And that let me tell you, I don't want to get fucking old. Because I don't want you fuckers looking after me in your cruel fucking way. Look how you are with your fucking friends. You couldn't give a fuck. You run off on them. You fucking smash into them. You steal them cars. You've got no fucking idea. And you all think you're fucking some sort of TikTok fucking famous cunt, right? You're not going to earn a million bucks. That's the problem. That's the problem. Anyway, go get a pie. Hey.